Have you ever wondered about the fascinating symbols of ancient Egypt? Symbols that have stood the test of time and continue to captivate us with their mystique and power. Today, we'll explore the top 5 Egyptian symbols and uncover their rich history and meaning. Our first symbol is the Eye of Horus. This powerful symbol was believed to represent protection, good health, and divine power. According to legend, the Eye of Horus was a gift from the god Horus to his father, Osiris, who was the god of the afterlife. It was said to have healing powers and was used in medicine and healing rituals. Additionally, the Eye of Horus was also believed to symbolize the connection between the pharaohs and the gods. The pharaohs were often regarded as living embodiments of the gods on earth, and the Eye of Horus was used as a powerful symbol to represent this divine connection. In fact, the pharaohs often wore amulets of the Eye of Horus as a symbol of their power and protection. Our second symbol is the scarab. This fascinating symbol was associated with the god Kepri, who was the god of creation and rebirth. The scarab was often depicted as a dung beetle, which was believed to symbolize the rising sun and the cycle of life and death. The scarab was also used as a talisman of good luck and protection. The scarab was not only an important symbol in ancient Egypt, but it also held great significance in their religious beliefs. According to Egyptian mythology, the scarab was associated with Kepri, the god of the rising sun, who was depicted as a man with the head of a scarab beetle. The Egyptians believed that Kepri rolled the sun across the sky every day, just as a dung beetle rolls a ball of dung. This act of rolling was seen as a symbol of transformation and rebirth, as the beetle was able to transform waste into something useful. As a result, the scarab became a powerful symbol of renewal and regeneration, and was often used in amulets, jewelry, and funerary objects to provide protection and good luck to the wearer. Our third symbol is the Ankh. This iconic symbol was believed to represent eternal life and was associated with the goddess Isis. The looped cross shape of the Ankh symbolized eternal life, while the cross itself represented the four directions of the world. The Ankh was often placed in the hands of the deceased during burial as a symbol of their journey to the afterlife and their hope for eternal life. The Ankh was also closely associated with the gods and goddesses of ancient Egypt. It was often depicted being held by various deities, including Isis, Osiris, and Ra. In particular, the Ankh was closely associated with Isis, who was seen as the goddess of life and fertility. As a result, the Ankh became a powerful symbol of life, health, and prosperity. It was often used in amulets and other protective objects, and it was believed to provide the wearer with strength and protection. In addition, the ankh was also used in the process of mummification, where it was often placed on the chest of the deceased to symbolize the continuity of life after death. Our fourth symbol is the Jed. This ancient symbol was believed to represent stability, endurance, and strength. It was associated with the god Osiris, who was believed to have been resurrected after death. The jed was often depicted as a column with four horizontal bars, representing the backbone of Osiris. Of all the symbols in ancient Egypt, the jed is considered to be one of the most enigmatic. The meaning behind this symbol is still a subject of debate among scholars, but one thing that is widely agreed upon is its association with the god Osiris. According to legend, Osiris was killed by his brother Set, but was later resurrected with the help of the goddess Isis. It is said that the Jed represents the backbone of Osiris, which was restored by Isis after his resurrection. As a result, the Jed became a symbol of stability, strength, and resurrection. It was often depicted in tombs and funerary objects, and was believed to provide protection to the deceased in the afterlife. Our final symbol is the Cartouche. This unique symbol was used to represent the name of the pharaoh and was believed to have protective powers. It was often inscribed on monuments and tombs, as a way of protecting the pharaoh's name and legacy for eternity. The cartouche is a unique and distinctive symbol in ancient Egyptian iconography. It is an oval shape with a horizontal line at one end, and it was used to surround the name of a pharaoh or other important figure. The word cartouche actually comes from the French word cartouche, which means a box or oval shape used to contain a design or inscription. The cartouche was believed to provide protection to the person whose name was contained within it, and it was often used in amulets and other protective objects. The cartouche was also used as a symbol of eternal life and rebirth, as it was believed that the name of the pharaoh contained within it would live on forever. 
Today, the cartouche is a popular souvenir item in Egypt, and it is often sold as a personalized pendant with the wearer's name written in hieroglyphics inside the oval shape. These symbols hold deep meaning and significance in Egyptian culture and religion. They were used to represent the power of the gods and pharaohs, as well as the cycle of life, death, and rebirth. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.